And some plants, you got some troubled stuff. Is this weird weather really affecting our plants? Because we're going up and down with the temperatures. It actually, when it wasn't even 50 this morning, you mean you're not supposed to plant tomatoes until it starts warming up to 50? Yeah, yeah. I mean, you're probably noticing some tomato leaves curling. Um, it's not going to hurt them, but it definitely is messing with them. A little bit, but we'll talk about that in the 10 hour. Oh, okay. So someone sent this in. I was at my friend's house and noticed this plant with red ants on it. What is it? Okay, I get this question multiple times um, a month, actually. This is an Arum Italicum, it is a member of basically the calla lily. And those, you don't really notice the foliage. What happens is you notice the fruit forming after it flowers, and then they turn bright orange. Birds usually plant them. Now, they are poisonous. So if you have young kids or animals that like to eat shiny, bright fruits, I would remove it. And to remove it completely so it doesn't come back, you have to dig up the tubers, um, basically underground bulb-type structures. And those red ants on there are, I think, another species of aphids, which are everywhere right now because we really haven't hit those high high temperatures this weekend i have a feeling a lot of the aphids are just going to die off and dissipate with that heat so we'll just put up with them for a little bit longer but yeah if you don't if you have young kids afraid of them eating it go ahead and dig that plant up okay sounds good uh facebook marlene the plant lady when she's not here she checks it out yes. she talks to you and i don't tweet i joke that i meow <laughs> <laughs>